Honestly, Kasich should not be allowed to run. And I'll go opposite on you. He hurts Trump much more than he hurts Chris. And in New York, I, had, I have tremendous numbers in New York. And I have tremendous numbers in Pennsylvania. Those two numbers just came out from CBS. I guess you saw them. But Kasich shouldn't be allowed to run. Look, under the grounds that Rand Paul could have stayed in, and he had nothing. Uh, Marco Rubio could have stayed in. Jeb Bush could have stayed in. They all could have stayed in. They could have just stayed in. That's all he's doing. He's one for 29. And the one thing that he won barely, and if I spent one more day in Ohio, I would have beaten him, because I came pretty close. The only thing Kasich won was Ohio, where he's the governor, and where he has the machine working, which isn't doing well. It's in the middle of the pack of his neighbors. He's only in the middle of his pack. He's not doing well in Ohio. If you look at his neighboring states, he's exactly in the middle of the pack. That's not great. Kasich shouldn't be allowed to continue, and the RNC shouldn't allow him to continue. And Kasich has more of an impact on me than he does uh, Cruz. Why is a guy allowed to run? All he's doing is just he goes from place to place and loses, and he keeps running. Well, why doesn't Marco Rubio do that? Why doesn't Jeb Bush do that? Why didn't all of them do that? After it was their time. Now, if he wants to go and have his name put in nomination in the convention, in the convention, he can do that. He doesn't have to run and take my votes because he's taking my votes. He's not taking Cruz's votes. He's taking my votes. 